All right, so we got here Diesel Truck Wars 2021. Beautiful day outside. Trailblazer out here. Gonna be running this in 770 today. Manny gonna be running ET with the Silverado SS. And my boy Charles gonna be running the Warthog in ET as well. So did a little testing last week, got it all figured out. Did pretty good, pretty happy with it. So went a 774 in this. The blue truck went a 81 and we actually took a little bit more weight out of it since we tested it last. So hoping that thing right there is gonna go 870s. Weather's pretty good. Air's like negative 500 feet right now. So hoping that'll work. Get the nitrous bottle set in this. We're pretty close. Just waiting on the pressure to come up on that a little bit. A little chilly out here today. It's about 54 degrees. And they've just started running the diesels up there. So we're gonna go ahead. Jumping in the lanes here in a minute. See y'all up there. Charles, how you doing, brother? Oh, those, those glasses are nice. <laughs> so here we go. First hit of the day. Hoping we can kind of go off that 74 pass that we made the other weekend. Get a little closer. Got pretty much the same tune up in it, so it ought to be pretty close. So I'm thinking anywhere from probably... Uh, 68 to maybe, I don't know, uh, 78. So we'll see what happens and go from there, guys. Want to get strapped in, helmet on, have some fun. All right, guys, here we go. First hit, 770 index. So it spun like crazy that first run. So I got to take some power out of it on the hit. And then uh, we'll try and put a little bit of power in it back up top. Went a 91. That, that ain't going to do it. So stop, regroup here, and go from there. baby here we go second shot After the first hit, Chuck went a 967 in the dually. Mandy went a, I believe, an 876 in ET. And then I made a hit in 770, spun like crazy, went 891. And then 
I took some power out of it down low, added it up top, and made a hit in ET just to get the time run. And it spun again, but we went 784. So anyway, pulled some more power out down low, put more power in up top. We'll see what happens. Go from there. All right, here we go. Second time run in 770. Oh boy, hope we got it a little closer. It's uh, kind of a common theme last two weeks as we've been struggling trying to run the number here, but it should be a little bit better now. All right, guys, I got my boy Dennis Harnish this round. Only second time run, but it's going to be a good one. It's gonna be a good one. Oh boy, woo! That was a good run. That was a good freaking run right there. Here we go. Time shot number two in the ET class. Just gonna use this for a time run. All right, here we go. a uh, 768 772 I think we got our number for first round Whew, man wow so first round coming up 770 I think we're just gonna go ahead and forego ET now focus on 770 see who we got hopefully we have a little luck here and go from there guys so let's see if the old magic tune up center all right, guys, first round here, 770. Hopefully we got a little bit of luck on our side. I feel pretty good. All right, let's have some fun.
All right, baby. Woo! That's one. On the brakes, one of 784. So, round one recap. The track has gone away. So, thankfully, I was able to pull off the win in 770. Unfortunately, Mandy fell victim to the 60 foot slowing up like crazy. So, she got knocked out first round. She's bummed, but hey, what are you going to do? It's part of it. So, let's go, guys. Here we go. Second round, 770. I'm praying this thing cooperates at 60 foot. guys double breakout man double breakout i went 66 he went 68 ah oh, he's a good old racer though he deserves it Whew, man this weekend did not go how we planned but you know what guys that's how racing goes sometimes we'll regroup bring her back figure out what we learned and go from there Really wanted that win though. Really, really wanted that win though. All right, guys, what a night. Uh, awesome event, they had over 100 trucks. Had a great time, I love that event. Unfortunately, the we just struggled with the 60 foot on both trucks. Uh, this thing fell off first round, it spun like crazy and unfortunately because of that, Manny wasn't able to run the numbers. So she got knocked out first round. Uh, my buddy Chuck in the dually, he broke out by 7,000's first round, and then second round in 770. My buddy Taylor, he handed me the L, real close race. I just didn't do my job down at the finish line. I tightened it up. I just didn't tighten it up enough. Double breakout. It's freaking racing, so what are you going to do? It was a great race, though. Silver lining here. So, I actually think we got this truck fast enough to set the bolt on Silverado SS record. So naturally aspirated, you know, stock long block with just bolt-ons. Uh, we went 862, which if you do the, the math on that in the quarter mile, that's about a 1345. Probably do the cam only record after that. So yeah, guys, we're gonna go ahead and focus on trying to get some records with this thing. So bolt-on record, I wanna go for the cam only record. I think it'd be pretty cool to do that and do it on a really affordable platform that you guys can replicate and do it yourself so we're gonna work on this uh street car takeover is coming up we've got that the end of april in bristol dragway probably one of my favorite tracks and then the following week is street truck takeover in atlanta uh, that's going to be a haul as is bristol but i really i really want to go to atlanta so i think we're going to go ahead and try and make that happen so anyway guys i got a lot of freaking work to do before then we'll catch you later Thank you.